Down here, the hatch is going to be supported by these brackets that I made up. These brackets match the contour of the roof. See, they've got the little cutouts to match that contour. The one on the other side, not only does it match the contour, but it has an additional piece attached to it, which will attach to this rib in the roof. I drilled two rib nuts using existing holes. All I had to do is make the holes a little bit larger, tossed in two rib nuts. So this will lock up. If I get this just right, bonds in just like that. And yeah, that's going to be good. Now, let's see if my drill holes line up. Yep. So my rib nut hole there. And here, yep, lines up. These will be put up with construction adhesive and put up there overnight and uh, they'll be permanent. Then we'll add the struts on the side later. So that's how this is going to be held up. And that's what I'm going to do right now. First, I'm going to take this down because that is going to hold this piece up. I drew that Sharpie line because I need to rough up the paint. I'm going to use a 40 grit sandpaper and rough that up so that it will adhere better with the construction adhesive. This is PL Premium. I also use this on the front doors, the sliding doors for the front of the vehicle, the partition doors, if you've taken a look at that video. three hands. All right, this might be pretty funny. my hand stuck in there. Ta-da! All right. A little more pressure. in there, right? 